Ah, check it out. This is why you dig up gravel. It starts, it looks like. Yeah, it looks like it starts up here. Okay, seal that off. Alright, good. What's over here? Nothing! uranium. <laughs> Looks like there's multi-levels to this. Which is interesting. Hmm. Alright, so... Keep pulling up the track. Just need to find chest with some melon seeds in it. Okay. Hmm. Yeah, I think I recognize this a little bit. Not much though, just a little bit. Some of it looks a little familiar. And you'll see torches aren't always where they would be normally. I have placed a few torches. Like I think all the torches on the ground are mine. So but this is good because now I'll know tracks are only areas are only in areas where I've not been. Oh, hello. Okay, cool. I can come up here. I didn't even notice this. Ah, oops. Now oh, that's gonna hurt. <laughs> yeah, I recognize this. Turn that off. Okay. Anything? It's dropped in here now. Alright. Track over there. And that's where I just was. Ah! Ah, cool. Maxed out on tracks. Okay, um, 64. Wow, that was fast. Alright, uh, um, hmm. Hey, hey, uh, what should I drop? What should I drop? What should I drop? Let's see, I can make some torches. But that's all I can do before I will max out on that. Okay, that works. Then I need the wood. I'll, yeah, I'll drop the string. Okay, good. Good. Alright, so... Hmm, this looks nice and dark. And boring. And this is... 
this is a complete dead end. Great. Unless it... Ah! It does go places. Interesting. Okay. Alright. I don't care about the lapis lazuli. Gold. Pumpkin seeds. I already have everything here, but I need to get rid of the chest because otherwise I won't realize I've already picked it up. So, uh, do I drop it? Um, I guess I should just drop the armor because it's not like the armor is going to ever help me. So. I take things down because I can't see what I'm doing. I do not like the sound of that. Ooh. Spider spawner. Well. I see you. Go this way. Yeah, good grief. Gotta stop jumping when the monsters startle me. down here. Man, that spawner up there is probably putting out a lot of spiders. It's certainly sounding noisy. that I'm not going to be able to get back to where I was. I don't really want to go down there. Not just yet, anyway. Great. Um. Oh, hello. That's convenient. Hello, creeper. You may not pass up here. You have to stay down there now. So nothing this way. I don't really want to go down there. <laughs> With lava, I don't get the torch. Alright, so I'm going to go back this way and see if I can... Oh, cool. I'm going to see if I can... Find my way back to that spider spawner I saw and sort that out. Okay, so this is the same area it looks like. Yeah, this looks like the same spot. Is, yeah, okay, this is where I fought the creeper and Looks like I'm exploring a little bit anyway. The, okay, so... Okay, let's not go that way. Tracks up there, and there's water up there as well. Uranium. Alright. More uranium. Alright, okay. And that oh, it goes down here as well. And there's an underground pool. Not going to go that way. Not just yet, but I will block the water off. Good. 
Okay, now I come back up here. Come back up here. Do that. Okay, that's very looking ominous. I'm going to grab this first before I go up the clearly very ominous staircase. staircase. Now, query. Is this the same or a different spawner? And will I get jumped? There's bones here, this, that. Uh, it's a, the same spawner. Good. Tracks off that direction. Alright, first I need to decide whether I want to bring the spawner or not. Tracks spawn quite a long ways that direction. Um, spawners are useful. But I've already got all my traps going. But they're extremely rare. Alright, I'll bring it. I want to go that way first. So, what should I drop? Fences. The cool thing about my nano sword, my nano saber actually, is it only drains power when it's activated. When it's not activated, it's essentially a weak sword with infinite durability. What that means then is that I can use it to break things that are better with a sword, but that would normally cause X2 durability loss without any durability loss, but with the speed bonus. Slick. Okay. Yep, more track under your gravel. Ooh, slime. Nice. Starting to get the looping thing. I'm starting to loop around a bit, so that's interesting. This goes down quite a ways pretty quickly. Gold. Oh, shoot. Lightsaber. Lightsaber. Nano saber is on. Hmm. I kind of don't want to stray too far into the caves for a couple reasons. One. It's easy to get lost in the case. Well, easier, I suppose. And I'm trying to find a very specific item. Chests with melon seeds. And I'm not going to find chests with melon seeds in the caves unless I get, I suppose, like really lucky and find a... Uh, Find a uh, cave that's got an abandoned mine shaft chest in it, but other than that, I just really think I should stay near the um, abandoned mine shaft. So, with that in mind, I'm going to do that as soon as I finish. Hmm. 
Trying to decide if there's anything up interesting up here. There we go. Because I keep seeing light. And I think what I'm seeing is the fog, actually. Oh, hello, creepers. Three creepers, wow. Not creepers. But I'm getting. I'm more creepers. Five creepers. Six creepers. Good grief. This is all the creepers. Right, um, I should. Oh, yeah, slime. Huh. Slime balls. Alright. Um. Oh! Well, how about that? Oh boy. Out of torches. And I haven't been collecting coal. Uh, right, I can't proceed without torches. Are you serious? I'm back to here. Oh, no, I see. This, okay, I'm not back to the original flint and gravel spawn. This is the second one. Did that for a second there. <laughs> I'm worried. This is... Ah, and coal. How nice. This is really, actually, quite fun. Abandoned mine shafts. This is what they're really good for. So. There's an area up there. Is that a staircase going down, or is that something I came up already? Can't tell. Right. Sticks. Oh, right, I wasn't collecting the. Oopsies, I just made a mistake. Okay, good. Portable workbench. Not irreplaceable, but I don't want to replace it. I've had it for a long time. Portable workbench is. was actually created originally by Kingby Dogs in the advanced Minecraft mod, which made Minecraft easier. <laughs> I should probably look where I'm going before I start jumping around. And then it, uh, unfortunately that mod has been long since defunct. Last version it worked on was 1.2. Yeah, way back when. So I'm trying to get up there. Anyway, um, uh, what was I saying? And why am I not carrying my sticks? Uh, 1.2 Advanced Minecraft, yeah. So, uh, fortunately, um, what's his name? The Crush has kept the portable workbench updated, so that's very nice. Alright, um, guess I'll just drop those. It's not like there's any lack of wood around here. Ah! Hmm. <laughs> I want... Melon seeds! Oh, whoa! Wow! Alright. Didn't know big rooms like this appeared. But I. Oh, hello. Guess they do. Oh, and their spawner. And I have been poisoned. Poison visual effect. I'm not actually poisoned because my helmet prevents such things. Like 
thankfully. Oh, hello. Another spawner. Hm. Oop, wrong button. <laughs> right click the spawner, because I still have the spawner GUI. That's the mod that from Rishigami that lets me gather them. Oh really, a dead end. Well that's just annoying. Yeah, dead end. Oh, Alright. Anything that way, alright. And it doesn't seem to be anything this way. Okay. is familiar. Slick. I wonder if... huh. I can't wait to review my footage and see just which spider spawner I picked up first. Because I'm suddenly wondering if maybe this spider spawner was actually the first one I originally saw. Hmm. Oh well. I guess those green bubbles would go away. haven't been here. This begs the question of where am I? It also begs the question of if you're picking up just little bits at a time, how come there's already been two full stacks of rails? It really is an illusion because you really don't think you're picking up that many. Alright, the pickaxe is leaving. them, whatever they are. Hmm, I've maxed out on wood too. It's not good. Yeah, this looks familiar. But that's new. This is old. Hmm. Huh. I'm not sure it's like this. Alright, I'll come there in a second. Let me go back this way first. Ah, oh, there you go. Oh, no, they're still there. I was gonna say they were finally gone, but then they weren't. And where did those rails go? There they are. I've been here before. This looks vaguely familiar. Good. Nice dead end. I like those. I hear water, but... Anything down here? Looks like no. Okay, come this way. Oh, hello, creeper. Oh, shit! Oh, I couldn't... Two creepers. One right after there. Oh, well. Never saw the first one. Heard it. The second one... Uh, sorry, I never saw the second one. The first one... I just couldn't hit him. I'm gonna have to review the footage on that. There we go. These bubbles have got to go away. Not even sure I really am poisoned. Hmm. That was the last second. Um, there, I saved and reloaded and the bubbles went away, because I was suddenly realizing that it was probably a visual glitch at this point. 
So, very good. I'm not going to directly blame the bubbles for hindering my creeper fighting, but... They're green. Bubbles are green. Anyway. So... Now, I've been here before. Huh, what's up there? Now it's a, another way around. Okay. Oop, there's track over there. That means I haven't been there. So let's go there now. Give me a back rub. Okay, don't see anything else. Let's go ahead and come on down here. Looking for ah track. Here we go. Yeah, this is where I saw from over there. Clearly, I haven't lit this whole area up yet. Hmm. There's track over there. There's dark over here. There's track down there. Okay, grab this first. Water. I don't particularly care for water. I mean, water's fine, it's just it's irritating. There we go. Right, this looks like ooh, more track down this way. Oh, a skeleton. Hey, it looks like I've been here before, I just haven't big picked up the track, so that's interesting. up here. Yeah, this links back up to the others. Sure. Oh. Looks like I'm pretty near the surface. Because I remember there's all that sand everywhere back up there. So I'm not surprised I'm seeing sand. Oh, group of two. That's pretty rare, actually. At least for me. Don't know whether it's intended to be rare or not. Hmm. I don't really want to drop down there. Not right now, anyway. I've seen that already. Here we go. More uranium. What was that? I thought I saw something there. Okay, uranium. Thank you. And I did get it, right? Okay. Alright, uh, let's see. There we go. First, now I'm getting back into the case again, getting away from the abandoned mine shaft. <laughs> that was interesting. But the footage on that looked like it was being held up or something. Anyway, okay, let's get back over here. I need to get back to the mine shaft. Right, here we go. It's more dark. Mine shaft's that way. Creepers this way. Came from up there. Oh. Come on down. <laughs> Survive the hit. Cool. Well, I mean, not cool. I prefer my nail saber one hits everything. But, alright. And yeah, more track. More track.
track in both directions. Hmm. And have I been out of here? Hmm. Because there's gravel in the ground, but I've collected the track. I mean, yeah, but I haven't collected the track, so that's interesting. But, whatever. Can live with that. Where's that creeper? I'm highly suspicious that there was a creeper and now I can't find him. Oh well. It's not like they can actually hurt me. And I've hit my third stack of track. Seriously, just is lots of track down here. Um I need to be throwing more torches down. Intention, but it certainly looked cool. Okay, dead end. Hmm. There's track over there. Please, 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 please. Yes! Mission accomplished! Yes! Alright! Now, new mission. Finding room in my inventory. <laughs> Torches can go. Alright! Mission accomplished! Wow, that feels good. Alright. Um, oh yeah, I have to actually have them on my bar there. For V to work. Okay, so, objective complete. New objective, escape. <laughs> and this is one of those rare times where I wish this was Terraria. And I could just go click on my magic mirror and be home again. In case you don't know, magic mirror is an item in Terraria that when clicked, teleports you to your spawn point. So... Hmm. I know there's actually a... Um... Right, this is just back... Hmm. Anyway, I know there's actually an item in... It's a mod item that complements industrial craft. It's sort of a handheld teleporter. Teleports you... I guess to wherever you set it to teleport you to. But, uh, wasn't compatible with my mod selections, so I had to pass on it. But that would have totally worked right here. But there it was. That is awesome. So all this time was actually not all that far away from where I've been. Well, that's. Alright, I guess. So now I just have to avoid dying. Because if I die, I have all the melon seeds on me. So if I die, I'm going to be very, very upset. Fortunately, though, I am invincible. And that actually, there are a lot of mobs down here. There are a lot of mobs down here. Huh. Map is I don't care. Redstone, I don't care. Right now, uranium. 
I um, do care. And diamond! Sweet. Since I uh, need like 40 diamonds, diamonds are actually rare enough for me to bother grabbing. Eh, three diamonds. Of course I have no... Ooh. <laughs> ah, I'm so glad they didn't fall in the lava. Um... What to pull out? Everything's so important. Uh, I guess the lapis lazuli, because I have lots of it. Alright, the, the diamond is like really important. More lava this way. Gold. I can grab that. I, um, I'm a little concerned that I'm not going to be able to necessarily find my way back out that easily. Oh, nice room here. Okay. Um, I'm not going to jump. I could totally make that jump, but... Alright, let's see. I came from that direction. Came from this. Ooh, there's more diamond up there. I would have totally missed that if I hadn't gone that way and then come back. Okay, no more diamond. Alright, so then I came from this direction. Right, came from up there, looks like. Eh. Wait, is that a... That's not the stronghold. That's the stronghold? You mean... The... Huh. I'm not entirely sure where I am, but I'm back in the stronghold. And you know what that means? It means I can easily... Okay, so not easily, but I could probably find my way back out. Oh yeah, see? I've been here. In theory. Yeah, I recognize this little thing. Okay, so I just have to find my way back. Alright, um, so this has become a maze again, but I made a good haul. A couple stacks of track, the, obviously the objective I came here for, melon seeds, eh, pumpkin seeds, I already had pumpkin seeds actually, I don't know if I mentioned that. I think I opened my chest where they were briefly earlier, so they were probably probably have spotted them then, but, uh... Ah! Here we go! End portal's that way, so the base is this way. Awesome! That was actually relatively simple. Okay. Need to get pressure plate here. Alright! So, yeah, heading back to the base here. Okay. So, I am really, really happy right now. So, let's just get up here and dump everything off in my chest. Alright, how are you doing on health? Fifty... no. Oh, five. Huh. I seriously doubt that I've actually been around for that long. But if I actually have been around for that long, then that would be pretty funny. Okay, bring you back up to 120. Alright, so let's sort this all out. Fish is food, so it goes up there. Uh. <laughs> cool. That was very cool. I'm gonna have to go into the video and check that out. Alright, the gold goes there. Pumpkin seeds, I already had four. So that's good. Uh, Alright, actually, you know what? I'm gonna put the track up here as well. Because this is where you expect to find track. And then some monster spawners are in here. Need more ender pearls. I need 11 ender pearls total. And put that there. So, let's see, put that up there. Keep the craft book. Uh, I suppose I can leave it there. It's not like I need it. Melon seeds, yay! 
Melon seeds are a growable thing, so I think we put them there. Alright, dump the ores. Well, here we go. There. And there. <laughs> Rotary masters are so fast. And then, induction furnaces are really fast as well. There we go, I mean look at that, it's already done. And this is real time too. This is how fast they are. So Okay, like that. And that. Very good. Dump this in here. Okay. Oh yeah, uranium and gold. I still have that in my inventory. Dump the uranium gold. Dump the gold there, uranium there. I almost have an entire full stack of uranium. Um, I really probably should um, eventually build a uranium, well, a nuclear reactor. I just really don't feel like it. Okay, so I should probably stop right now and review the footage that I've got and see how it looks. But uh, yeah, I think this was a really good haul and melon seeds, hooray! So now I'm gonna have to extend my farming production a little bit. I'm not sure I can't really extend <laughs> either direction. That way, that way, or that way. I'm thinking I might... I've got a lot of reed going because I need a lot of reeds, but I'm thinking, in fact, yeah. I'll do this right now here. I'm just going to convert these two to melons and be done with it. Which is, that would be the simplest way. Yeah. Alright. That's easy enough to do then. So I'll do that real quick before I end the video. But then... Right, so I'm going to end the video. Here. Sort of. And... And then I'll work on that, because I need to work on that and give my dog a nice little place to hang out. And I'm probably going to let this grow a bunch of mush uh, mushrooms. Um, is that how that works? I'm trying to remember. I really... Okay, it looks like that works. I do not remember reading. I read it, sure, but I just don't remember the details of farming melons. But I am going to f let it figure it out here. Just like that. Put two there, and two there, and and let's see. So that let's see. Actually, now I need to think about this here. Can I get the back? No, I cannot get the back. Okay, so um, I didn't quite think this through here. So I'm gonna put that back there. I'm gonna go get my bone meal and pop them to full size, because I didn't quite think this through. I forgot that they don't just grow, they need adjacent space. So... That's a little bit unfortunate, but I still have four seeds. So... So I'll just do this. Okay, I'll let those spawn melons, I'll harvest the seeds, and then I'll rearrange it. So I'll probably... Hmm. Well, I'll figure out how I want to do it. And I'll get it all going, but I'll do that all off camera. I've probably gone way over 30 minutes. This has probably become two episodes at this rate. But, uh... Yeah, although if it's been the full two and a half hours, it could easily <laughs> be like four, five episodes of footage. 
the yeah I'm thinking I'll just because I don't really need a ton of space over here so I'll probably turn a bit of this into fencing and have it open and let my dog just sort of roam there so I can see my dog from either side I don't have a gate that kind of thing that's what I'm thinking I'll do yeah I'm liking this so I'll maintain my tunnels and by the way future expansion tunnels is actually a deliberate joke it's like don't go down here nothing interesting totally boring and then it's my bedroom the enchantment room the teleport room so I did that on purpose I don't know because when I uh, originally put the sign there I was like dude wasn't it like episode two episode one I can't remember actually but um back then it really was future expansion tunnels and it wasn't until later that I actually um, expanded upon it and it became um, what it is now so anyway Hmm. No, no, I remember now. It's the other way around. Because I think it's the other way around. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> That's cool. This is actually a really kind of funny feature. Hmm. Except, I, you'd think that he'd come, he'd go to the bone and come straight back. No. Still. It's a nice feature. Come to think of it, I bet it probably... Oh, you know what? I just realized something. I bet you can use it to control where he goes. Because he has to bring it back to you. Right? Yeah, well, sort of. So it sort of works. very least it can force him to go to a certain area. <laughs> Alright, well, there it goes. Oh, right, no, uh, mm -mm getting stuck on the furnace because it's well it's getting stuck on the furnace. I'm trying to eh. Alright, well furnace can go I suppose. There he goes. Hey come back, where are you going? Sit, 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 sit. There. Okay. Alright. Okay, so yeah. Well, that was fun. So I guess just put it back in the chest here. Cause this chest seems to be the one holding my food, but also my doggy supplies. Which makes sense, I suppose. It's right next to the dog. Alright, well, I am going to end this video here. I have no idea. I've probably gone way over time. And I'm going to have to cut this into several videos, but I had fun, and I will see you in the next part. Bye!